Are Newfoundland dogs good with small children? Newfoundland dogs, also known as Newfoundlands or Newfs, are a large and gentle breed that is often described as the gentle giants of the dog world. With their imposing size, thick coats, and webbed feet, these dogs have long been known for their strength and skill in water rescues. But are they good with small children? In this article, we will explore the nature of Newfoundland dogs and their compatibility with young kids. Temperament and Characteristic Traits Newfoundland dogs have a reputation for being loving, patient, and gentle. They are known to have a calm and sweet nature, making them an excellent choice for families with small children. Their innate protectiveness and natural instinct to care for others often extend to children, making them great companions for little ones. These dogs are highly intelligent and easy to train. Their nature as working dogs has made them excellent in tasks such as water rescues, but it has also made them good companions for children. With early socialization and proper training, Newfoundland dogs can develop into well-behaved members of the family. Physical Stature and Adaptability Newfoundlands are large dogs, with males weighing between 130 and 150 pounds and females weighing between 100 and 120 pounds. Their size makes them appear intimidating to some, but in reality, they are gentle giants who are naturally good with children. Their imposing stature even serves as an advantage as it allows them to protect and watch over their small human counterparts. Their thick and dense coats make them well suited for colder climates, but they can adapt well to different environments. However, it is important to note that their long fur requires regular grooming to keep it clean and healthy. This grooming routine can also be a great way for children to learn responsibility and develop a bond with their fur buddy. Supervision and Interaction While Newfoundland dogs have a gentle nature, it is still important to supervise their interactions with small children. This is especially true when both the dog and the child are still learning and developing their understanding of boundaries and appropriate behavior. Regardless of the breed, dogs should never be left alone with young children. This precaution helps ensure the safety of both the child and the dog. Teaching children how to properly interact with dogs is crucial. They should be taught to approach gently and to avoid sudden movements or actions that may startle or scare the dog. It is also important to teach children to respect the dog's personal space, as all dogs, including Newfoundlands, appreciate having their own quiet area where they can retreat to when needed. Bonding Opportunities Newfoundland dogs thrive on companionship and enjoy being part of a family. They form strong bonds with their human family members, including children. The bond between a Newfoundland and a child can be truly special, as these dogs have a gentle and patient nature that complements the exuberance and energy of young kids. Daily activities such as walks, playtime, and obedience training can help strengthen the bond between a child and their Newfoundland dog. These activities can also help expend the dog's energy, which is vital for their overall well-being. Conclusion In conclusion, Newfoundland dogs are generally good with small children. Their loving and gentle nature, combined with their protective instincts, make them excellent companions for young kids. However, it is crucial to remember that proper supervision and socialization are key to ensuring a harmonious relationship between a Newfoundland and a child. By teaching children how to interact with dogs safely and responsibly, the bond between a child and a Newfoundland dog can be one filled with love, trust, and lasting memories.